Hi, I'm Philip from Optimize Lab, and in this video, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to optimize your campaigns using gender demographics. Now, to start off with, what do I mean by gender demographics? Well, every campaign that you set up within Google Ads is going to target uh, a number of users, and it's going to target them based on a number of criteria that you set. And one of those criteria is the user's gender. And Google generates information about users through a number of different streams, including those users' Google accounts. So Google knows for a percentage of users whether they're male or female. Otherwise, Google will um, classify them as undetermined. And based on that data, you can see are males performing better within your campaign, or is it females? Which one is generating the most revenue for your company? You may also have internal company data, which tells you which of your customers, which uh, gender is really generating a lot more revenue for your business. And therefore, based on that information, you can adjust your targeting within Google Ads. And then as a result of that, you can save on ad spend and maximize the revenue you're generating from your campaigns every single month. So how do you find that data within Google Ads? Well, if you're in the campaigns section like we are right now, then you can go ahead and um, navigate over to the left um, navigation bar here and click where it says audiences and open that in a new tab. Now, I actually have that opened up in this tab already in this example account. So I'm just going to scroll down once we're in the audiences section here. And we're going to scroll down to this demographics section here. And reviewing this section, we can take a look at um, the gender performance. So you want to make sure you've clicked here where it says gender and you have that section open. And you can see the data for females, males, and also unknown. So the first metrics we're going to look at for the purposes of this example analysis is we're going to look at conversion rate. So if you click here in this drop down menu and then go to the conversions menu and then click here where it says conversion rate, that's going to load up the conversion rate data for each gender. Additionally, on the right hand drop down menu, we're going to do the similar thing. We're going to go conversions and then we're going to click where it says cost per conversion. And so we're going to see this data for male versus females and also versus unknown. So we can see here that the conversion rate is significantly higher for females when Google is aware that the visitor is a, uh, the user is a female. So we're seeing a higher conversion rate. And at the same time, we are seeing a lower cost per conversion. So the conversion rate is 6%, 6.6. And then for males, it's 0.77%. Um, so it's um, significantly higher for a female audience. Now, at the same time, we're seeing a low cost per conversion of £160 for females. And if we compare that to male, it's £227. Um, so there's a big disparity between the two of those. And so based on that information, we may conclude for this particular product or service that actually we want to be generating more females to uh, using our ads to the website in order to generate those conversions. Um, now, if you have internal data, which also tells you that females tend to be better customers or better clients for your company, for whatever reason, you're generating more revenue from females, then that may be an additional incentive for you to be bidding higher for females. So if after reviewing the data, and of course this is just an example account, but if after reviewing your data using a similar, similar analysis to this that you've decided, actually I wanna be spending more for a particular group, then what you can do at that point is add bid adjustments in order to increase your bids when Google knows that that user falls into that gender category. So if that's the case and you do want to adjust those bids, then what you can do is make sure this table is open where it says here, hide table. So you want to go ahead and open that up. And then you want to 
do a filter. So at the moment, we're going to filter for gender. And then we're going to select one of the groups here. So for this example, I'm going to select female and then click apply here. And so once I've clicked apply, what that's going to do is it's going to make sure that we're only looking at the data uh, uh, and um, the settings for females for every single ad group that we have within this report. So to adjust those bids, now all I have to do is click here in the top left hand corner of this table and then select all. So we want to select all of the ad groups that are targeting females. And we're going to go ahead and click edit here. And then we're going to click where it says change bid adjustment. And so this is where we can go ahead and add our bid adjustment. So for the sake of argument, if we want to bid more for females, like we do in this example, we can go ahead and add the percentage that we'd like to bid here. So for example, if we put 25%, then we're going to be bidding 25% more for if somebody's a female versus male or if they the uh, gender is unknown. And so we've got an example here that Google gives us. If your bid, for example, is £10, uh, generally speaking, then when they're a female, we're going to be bidding 25% higher, which would be £12.50. So once you've gone ahead and done that, you can go ahead here and click Apply. And then once we've clicked Apply, what you can see now is that for each of these um, ad groups, we can see that there is now a plus 25% bid adjustment for those ad groups. So we'll be bidding higher and we'll be able to generate uh, more traffic from that audience and therefore that can help to boost revenue and generate more sales overall for that business. So I hope this has been useful and informative and will help you to get better results from your campaigns. Um, if it has been, then feel free to subscribe. I'll be coming out with a lot of different tips and advice in order to help you get the absolute most out of your Google Ads campaigns. And thanks for watching.